Hey guys, let's talk about the modes of the major scale. So there are seven major scale modes. The first is called the Ionian scale, and that's simply playing from C to C, which we know is our major scale. So instead of calling it the C major scale, we've got the C Ionian scale. D to D is the Dorian scale. E to E is the Phrygian. F to F is the Lydian. G to G is Mixolydian. A to A, Aeolian. B to B is Locrian. And then of course we repeat the octave and that's the Ionian again. Why do I love these modes so much? Well, let's take a look at the first mode. If I put a C down here, we have of a C major scale, right? So we, that's the Ionian mode, right? And we can play over the C major seven chord change with obviously the C major scale. Well, when I was a youngster, I would see a chord like this and I would think, okay, and I would read the chord from left to right and I would think, well, that's a D major scale with a flat third and uh, a flat seven. Right, so I'd think F sharp and C sharp, but no, I'd have to make those natural and play C natural and F natural. Instead of just thinking of it as a D Dorian minor scale, which is going to get me to the same place a whole lot quicker. So I think D minor 7 is really a C major scale starting on D or D Dorian, okay? Well, let's take another chord like F major seven with the sharp 11. Then we've got your F major scale, right? F to F with one flat, B flat. But the sharp 11, if we keep going, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, 11. Notice that the 11 is the same here, so we're going to raise that, and here's actually the 4, because the 4 and the 11 are the same note, so we make it, we raise it from flat to natural. So F7 sharp 11. Do those notes f look familiar to you? Does it look like a C major scale starting on F? Yes, yeah, so once again, we go back to our C major scale. Okay. What if we've got a minor 7. Now we can either use this as Dorian minor, but what if we do natural minor? So A natural minor is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A. The sixth mode of the major scale or the Aeolian mode, right? Take a look at this. Doesn't this look like a C major scale starting on A? So I think of all my scales um, I simplify them this way. I don't think flat third, flat seven, anything like that. I like to just think of it, okay, well, this is a C major scale starting on A. I get to it a lot quicker in my mind. It's just, it's just how I do it. You can do it a lot of different ways. You can also think, all right, well, this is a major scale with a flat third and a flat seven, okay? But why not think of it in a C major scale and bam, I've got it under my fingers a lot, a lot quicker. All right, so this is the Aeolian mode, all right? Let's go to B half diminished, okay? Also written as B minor seven flat five. Well, that's simply B Locrian, okay? You can think of it of, uh, uh, as a couple different ways. You can think of it as start on B and play the major scale up a half step, or you think of the seventh mode of the major scale. So I know if you're not familiar with modes, this is a little bit confusing, but for me, it's a, it's a lot simpler to think in modes when I'm negotiating chord changes in jazz. Let's do one more. G7. G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Okay? If I think of G major with a flat seventh, I can do that. Or, I mean lowered seven, or I can think of this is just a C major scale starting on G. Doesn't it sound and look a lot simpler? 
So look at how many chords we can play just with the C major scale. C major 7, F major uh, 7 sharp 11, B half diminished, A minor 7, D minor 7. Uh, what did I leave out? G7, okay? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and we actually could think of also yeah, Phrygian mode is also minor, E minor 7. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 chords that you can use, um, uh, that you can play over by just using the C major scale. All right? So that's how I think of modes. That's just one way. Okay? Hopefully that's not too confusing. And once again, using modes to simplify playing over chord changes. If you go to my website at jefflewistrumpet.com, you can download the free PDF of all of these uh, major scale modes in C. And if you subscribe to my email list, you will get the book 11 Scales for Jazz Improvisation. So hopefully that's going to help you out with your improvising. Okay, please feel free to email me at jeff at jefflewistrumpet.com if you have any questions. Like, subscribe, all that YouTube stuff. Give me a comment below if you have any questions. And hopefully that helped you out. All right. Thanks for watching.